Looks like we're playing at the beach again. Today I'm going to tackle a new way to teach you how to get out of the bunker. We spent a lot of time talking about the do's in a bunker, the things that we recommend that you do do to hit it well and get out of a bunker, but it seems like a lot of you need a little bit more help. So today we're going to do the opposite. We're going to give you the don'ts. Don't forget to dig in your feet. I see a lot of people who just step into a bunker and hit the ball. Well, ideally, we're going to try to hit underneath the ball with our sand wedge or our lob wedge. We're going to open up the face a little bit to create uh, the right loft and to activate the bounce. But I see a lot of people just step right in and hit the ball. So don't forget to dig in your feet. That is number one. Number two, don't forget that by hitting this golf ball first, that's a huge mistake. If I'm in a bunker, unless it's a fairway bunker, I never want to hit this golf ball. So after I dig my feet in, I'm going to figure out where's this imaginary line that I need to hit that's behind this golf ball. What I don't want to do, step in and then just hit the ball. Holy smokes. Oh my Lord. I just hit the water hazard twice. Dig your feet in. Don't hit the ball first. Third, don't be silly. This is not a normal golf swing. Don't swing normal. If you're in a bunker, you got to create a swing that goes more up and down and then around, right? That's not a normal golf swing. So don't forget that you need to hinge, swing more upright, hit behind the golf ball where you put that imaginary line, and then exit left with an open face. That is not a normal golf swing. Last but not least, don't forget you need to practice. Whether you go out in the afternoons or early mornings, hit a couple extra bunker shots or go to your local practice facility, this is not easy. The best bunker players in the world have spent hours on hours in a bunker getting comfortable. So don't forget these things. Don't forget to dig your feet in. Don't forget that you need to create an imaginary line behind the ball, two or three inches. Don't forget that you need to swing a little differently, more upright, and don't forget that you need to practice these principles to be better out of the sand at Monarch Beach Golf Links. Don't be silly, be awesome here at Monarch Beach.